In this video we will fix unable to connect please try again later in WhatsApp. So let's begin. So to solve the error of unable to connect please try again in WhatsApp. What you have to do is just go and off all the networks, networks you are currently connected with. If you are connected with the Wi-Fi just go and off it from here. If you are currently connected with the data connection just go and off it. Once you have off both uh, these connections just go to your mobile settings. Once that are open just go and tap on more. And here tap on cellular networks. And here just go and select the network you are currently using. It, uh, it may be Mobilink, Ufone or Airtel, Vodafone or any other network. Once you are there, just go and tap on the access point names or APNs. Just go and tap on it. And here just go and tap on the network you are currently using. And here just scroll down below. And here search for APN protocol. So here we have APN protocol, just go and tap on it. And set it to IPv4. IPv4, once you have set that. IPv4. And here in the APN roaming protocol, just go and set it also to IPv4. So we have set both of these to IPv4. Once you have done so, just close it. Again, go to your mobile links, mobile settings. Once you are in your mobile settings, just scroll down below and search for apps or application manager. Here we have apps, just go and tap on it. So once the apps are open, you might have to swipe twice left to get all the applications including system applications. In my case, they are already listed. So I will just go and tap on these three dots and here tap on reset app preferences. And here tap on reset apps. Once you have done so, just scroll down below and search for WhatsApp. So here we have WhatsApp. Just go and tap on it. And here tap on force stop. Tap OK. And here tap on storage. Tap on clear data. Tap OK. Once you have done so go back. You might get an option of clear data somewhere on this window. So if you are getting it here just go and tap on clear data. Once you have cleared the data just go and close all the windows. Just go and reboot your mobile. Once your mobile is rebooted, just go and on your connection and try to again log into your WhatsApp. This time you might get, uh, you might not get the option to send an SMS. So just go and tap on the call option. Once you tap on the call option, they will have a call with you and will give you a code to log in. So if you still have an issue, you can comment below. I will try to answer that. But before you go, please subscribe, like and share. Thank you.